Hello everybody and welcome back to Valkyrie Chronicles and uh, let's continue on with the story for a little bit. Um, but actually before I do that, um, I suppose I'll mention this, I may not uh, upload this every weekday, it might be every other weekday because the videos tend to be really long if the operations are included in them. But not only that, I have other uh, well, I don't want to have other things to do, but I want to enjoy my summer a bit, you know? That's pretty much it. I'm just not like I have any like other issues going on. I just really just want to enjoy my summer a bit. But I will try my best to record episodes and get them uh, uploaded. Huh? What's this supposed to be anyway? What a weird place for something like this. There you all are. Hey there, Faldio. I didn't know you were out here too. I'm an archaeology major, remember? I was ordered to observe the ruins interior. The shape of it really is unusual. I've never seen anything like it. I feel like I've seen it before somewhere. Hmm, where could it have been? This building was supposedly erected millennia ago by the Valkyrie themselves. So they actually existed then? Yes, the Valkyrie make a sudden appearance in European history thousands of years ago. Records say they brought with them incredibly advanced technology and divine might. Then one day, their history just ends. The Valkyrie just disappeared. I always thought they were just a myth. That's it. I remember now. Remember what, Welkin? What are you shouting about? The Dread Nautilus. This structure looks just like a Dread Nautilus. A Dread... Nautilus? What's that? You don't know? They're marine cephalopods. They live inside pointy spiral shells. And these ruins look just like that shell. I wonder if there's some connection there. Welkin, you can be such a... Hmm? What's up? Nothing. Forget it. Right. Let's take a look inside then. We may find some clue to why the Empire is out here. Alicia, I want you to come help Faldio and me look around inside. Largo, Rosie, and Isara, you stay here. Be on the lookout for movement in the area. All right, sir. Please be careful. Tell me, Silvaria, do these walls offer an answer to our search? I pray. Where sleeps the ancient power? What do you read, child? Valkov, the Holy Lance, scorcher of the vast earth, asleep eternal in the bosom of Grand Breeze. Made pillar of its keeper's keep, kept thereby for eon without end. Then it's true. The Sacred Lance lies buried within Ron Grease's walls. But your grace, how do you intend to control the Lance once it is found? <laughs> Worry not. A beast fit to bear that burden will soon be at our disposal. With this, our dream is made hard fact. Our crown shadow will extend to all of Europa. Chapter 7, The Battle at Barius.
seeing if there is any. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot about this. But let's see if there is anything new in the R and D facility. Welcome. Accuracy boost three. Looks like we'll be going through a, a rifle split soon. Nothing new for them. Nothing new for those. Oh yeah, if you're gonna do the skirmish just to grind money, I recommend you just do the first skirmish over and over again on normal because just because that's like the easiest skirmish to do. I don't have enough money for that. It doesn't look like there's any uh, big operation here. It might just be all cutscenes, actually. Nope, there's one operation for A. I see that there. Although it doesn't look as big as, like, say this one. So that might mean it's not as a, uh, might not be as big as a battle as that one. Or it could just be just as big. But either way, uh, before I do that, I'll grind a little bit. Actually, no, nah, I'll stop the grinding for now, if, but if I'm having too much trouble, well, I'll grind a little bit more. You still see it on a lot of old monuments. Do you know how to read it, Valdio? Yeah, we just covered it this last year. Let's take a look. It's more or less a recounting of the Darkson Calamity as the history books tell it. The Darksons unlocked some secret property of Ragnite and tried to conquer the continent. A hundred cities raised its fell light. 10,000 men and beast therewith. It says this area used to be one of the cities lost in that purge as well. So they did use Ragnite. It was in the middle of that destruction that the Valkyrer suddenly came into the picture. Supposedly they rose to face the Darksons, armed with sacred lances, blue with flame. That became the War of the Valkyrer. I had a picture book about that as a girl. But it's fiction, right? Like a fairy tale. Ruins like these dot the European map. Traces of the culture that once ruled the continent. The majority of the anthropological community now agrees that the Valkyrer did exist. Wow, this is so educational. The Valkyrer won and rose to power while the Darksons were scattered across Europa. There are some who worship the Valkyrer as the saviors of Europa even today. Meanwhile, the Darksons got branded with a stigma of their past and were persecuted. With no land of their own, they had to work as itinerant laborers and ragnite miners. 
Which is why there are so many Darksons still working in the industrial sector today. I never knew that. Come to think of it, Isara's dad was an engineer, wasn't he? Anyway, that's enough history for today. Let's keep checking for Imperial tracks. Yeah, this looks like this video is just going to be a lot of cutscenes. I've been looking, but I still ain't seen nothing but sand. Those imps got some strange tastes if they're sunning themselves out here. What's got you, Rosie? Ain't like you to be so quiet. You got the runs or something? You're foul, Largo. And I'm just annoyed. Takes some kind of brass to blow up a chunk of turf this big, don't you think? Looks like the dark hairs have been bad news for the rest of us folks since day one. What do you mean by that? <laughs> what do you think I mean? No archaeological proof exists to support the theory that Darkson's destroyed Barius. Look around! How much more proof do you need? And it's an unfair generalization to assume that all Darksons cause trouble for others. You saying you don't? Look, it's cause of you people that I, that my whole... All right, time out, you two. You stay out of this, Largo. We're on patrol here. You keep squawking and we're likely to get sniped. You too, kid. You know Rosie's got a temper on her. She wouldn't go off if you didn't talk back. I don't believe anything I've said is untrue. <sighs> Stubborn as mules, both of you. Folio, what is that? It's called the Valkyrian Spiral. Okay, so what is it? I was talking about their power before, remember? The sacred blue flame? The spiral motif on their relief carvings are said to represent inexhaustible power. Oh, I didn't know that. Still, we haven't seen any Imperials here. Not even any signs of entry. I guess it's possible that this wasn't what brought the Empire out here. Well, the others are waiting. Let's go back. Sure, let's go. What in the... Alicia, what just happened? I don't know. I barely even touched it, and this door just opened. Whoa. It looks like it keeps going. An underground chamber in the Barius ruins. This is a huge discovery. Should we go in? Do you have to ask? All right, let's take a look. Everywhere. What do they say, Falio? I'm not sure. I 
wish I could tell you they're too ancient for me to decipher. Welcome. We're not alone. Who's there? Well, how surprising to find you here. We don't get many visitors. I won't ask how you were able to break in. It's not really important. But you defile this sanctum with your presence. Uh, guys, that's Maximilian. Maximilian? Wait, but he's the enemy commander. Hold it right there! You take one more step and I'll shoot you down, I swear I will! Ugh! What? Lower your weapon. Your lives are worthless to me, but I do not wish to stain this sacred place with blood. If you are determined to have this confrontation, why don't we settle it outside? Welkin. Welkin? So... You're the brat who's responsible. My compliments for the vassal bridge and the base in Cloden. You quite impressed Jaeger. He was singing your praises, boy. Silvario, come. Sir. Now's our chance to take out their commander! She's right, Faldio. Let's go! Uh... right. Alright, just gonna see how long uh, that was, and if it's a decent length, I'll end today's video there.